Hi, this is David with Pacific Home Group and I got another great video coming your way. Today we're gonna discuss buying a condo slash townhouse over buying a single family home. Don't forget to smash that like and subscribe button to stay up to date with all of our real estate news, tips and tricks, and home tours. The difference between buying a single family home and a condo and a townhome. Um, this one hits home to me because for a long time we used to live in a townhome and I gotta tell you, it was pretty amazing. And the reason being, here's my reasons for loving living in a townhome. A, I didn't have a lot of maintenance on the outside. I mean, when I first got my house, I, I got a huge bill for tree trimming. That was, that was a new one for me. I spent over $1,500 trimming all the trees in my yard. Well, at the townhome and condo community, they did that all for me. I never had to deal with it. In fact, I didn't really have a backyard to maintain. It was kind of nice and easy. That brings me on to it's easier to maintain because you usually have a home warranty that maintains the outside of your property. The only thing you need to maintain is the inside. There's also when you're living in a condo or townhome, you're gonna have fancier amenities. Like we had a pool and a spa and a gym. We were gated, it was pretty cool. Insurance is usually cheaper on a condo townhome because the HOA covers most of your insurance where all you need to get usually is what's called an HO6 insurance. That's insuring all of your walls and stuff in. A little bit cheaper, they go anywhere between 30, 40 bucks. Don't quote me on that, but that was about the price that we were paying. HOAs also come with rules and regulations. You receive those when you're uh, first investigating the property. Check those out because sometimes they're gonna have dog and dog breed restrictions, things like that. Condos and townhomes are a little less private because you're so close together. The other thing that's interesting about a condo townhome, uh, they don't appreciate as much and they don't appreciate as fast as a home. Homes seem to appreciate higher in value and a little bit quicker. So buying a single family home, some of the benefits is you're gonna have more space, you're gonna have more privacy. Uh, you could have a yard maybe, hopefully. Um, that's kind of thing. You're not sharing walls typically in a single family home and it appreciates a little bit faster and a higher value. Don't forget to smash that like and subscribe button. That way you can stay up to date with all of our real estate news, tips and tricks and home tours. Thanks for watching the video. We'll see you soon.